And, uh, alright. You ready? Here's a hit. Here you go. Here you go. I want more defense grid. Defense grid. More. Without defense grid, where would I be? More defense grid. More. <laughs> Hi, it's Jeff and Jim from Hidden Path here for another update on the Defense Grid 2 Kickstarter. That's right. We're pretty excited. We are. You are too. We can tell that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, already this week we're over 60% of the way there. That's right. 3,725 backers as of this take. And they're over $153,000. So, that's so we news. really appreciate your help. Absolutely. Obviously, to reach the goals that we want to reach, we need to get more people in. More people. Um, and there's all sorts of things happening. We just did an interview with Inside Gaming Daily. That's right. And uh, they interviewed our, our CEO, Jeff Probst. If, uh, I, if I was Jeff Probst, I would have a lot more money. You're, you're not Jeff Probst? I'm not Jeff Probst. Well, that being the case... The uh, tribe has spoken. <laughs> it's good that we have our CEO with us today, <laughs> who is not Jeff Probst. It's Jeff Probst. It is. But that's okay. It, it happens. People like to add the R. And if the money came along with it, that would be a really good that'd thing. That would be great. And we wouldn't have to do a Kickstarter. But unfortunately, we do, because yes. it's not Jeff Probst. But... But Jeff, if you're out there and you want to give... <laughs> Yes. True. Yeah, you'd you be feel feel free to do it. Um, Mark Toronto today was on Reddit. That's right. In fact, has that actually concluded as of now? Um, he's still doing a few as we're recording this. Tomorrow, um, you can check. There's probably uh, over 200 questions that yeah, he's been answering I, he's, already. He's been very very busy. Yeah, and he may continue to answering more questions. I guess you can go back and you can check. So if you have a question that you're burning to ask Mark and you didn't get a chance to, um, you can go back to the Reddit and, and ask your question. Yeah, what a treat to get to talk to Mark Toronto, a very, uh, very well-established designer. Yeah, and with Age of Empires as background, talking about Defense Grid, talking about some of the multiplayer features of Defense Grid 2 made it in there. He was also giving out game codes today to people who were asking questions. And he talked about his past, working on all sorts of different things. Mm -hmm. um, it, was, it, it was very cool to see what the questions people had yeah, and, and, and what, what uh, little stories he was able to bring. Um, as each week, we do contests. Contests, and we have contest winners. When Jim, we contests. tell us about the contest well, winners. Well, uh, we've got uh, several winners this week. Uh, we've got uh, from the Alien Breeder mini game, Lost Soul, B-I-H, is the winner. Congratulations, Lost Soul. Uh, from the, uh, the level that was a fully loaded barrier to entry. Yes. Uh, Paralypsis, congratulations, Paralypsis, on your victory. And, uh, and the Shredder Infiltration level was... This one's a little harder, I think. It was the harder level? I think so. Zeme. Zeme is the winner. Congratulations to you, Zeme. Congratulations. So everyone who participated went into a drawing, and so then we drew from the people who mm -hmm. were on the leaderboards. And, uh, and congratulations to Lost Soul BIH, Paralypsis, and Zeme for winning AMD video cards this week. And we had a number of entries for the DG trailer. Exactly. And the winners from the DG trailer, what do they get, Jeff? Well, we had a random pick of everybody, and then we had the people with the most likes, or typically person, but again this week, we couldn't, we couldn't help ourselves. Mm -hmm. We had to do too. people. And again, all three of these video winners are winning AMD uh, video cards. That's fantastic, that's a great video card. And the random pick yes. from, uh, from the DG trailer, Plunder Bunny. Which uh, that's a heck, really a heck of a name. Yeah, I got yeah. the, Congratulations, the Plunder Bunny. of things like jump up in your mind. You don't think of a bunny plundering anything, but in this case, we have a plunder he bunny. He plundered off with an AMD card. <laughs> and then the, the two winners that got the, the most likes. Yes. Uh, Extra Noise. Extra Noise uh, did a great trailer. It was kind of moody and somber, kind of black and yeah. white. Very cinematic. With the, with the piano footage going on, it was really kind of... Uh, Ooh, ah, uh, moody. Yeah. yeah, a little different for the game, and then and then Froste. Yes, last week Froste gave us just after the deadline, and he submitted it, and it was kind of a trailer and more of a song about the Kickstarter. That's great. But we we couldn't resist. He if also you haven't got seen those. A, a ton of likes. Yeah. And so um, you, you'll see some of these right now, and then we'll put the links up to them. At, at the and end. if you haven't seen them already, please go and, and take a look at them. Very creative stuff. So congratulations to Plunder Bunny, Extra Noise, and Froste for their uh, video card submission wins. 
That's now, right. this upcoming week, we're going to do things a little differently. We're not going to do a video submission this week. We're going to take a week off from videos. Um, and we're going to do different prizes. Um, fresh out, out over here from our friends at Razor is a uh, Taipan mice. These are our special super high DPI mice. Um, and they have arrived in fine, fine shiny condition. And we're going to do four contests this week. And the contest winners are all going to win Razer Taipan mice, professional gaming mice. Do you want to uh, tell us what modes? This is a mode. We're going to reset the leaderboards on some existing modes. And we're going to introduce a brand new challenge mode to mm -hmm. the game. Mm -hmm. Do you want to tell us what that is? Uh, we've got uh, Ancient Research. The level fully of ancient loaded. research in the, in the main game. Yep, and it'll be fully loaded. The fully loaded mode is going to get a reset leaderboard. And then uh, uh, on Turnabout, I think we're going to have a Super Grinder mode. Yes. And then uh, finally in Lockdown, it'll be out of bullets, I believe. So all three of those modes exist right now, are getting leaderboard wipes. And to enter the contest for the Razor Taipan Mice, all you need to do is go and play those, and you'll be entered in the contest. Mm -hmm. And then we're adding a brand new challenge mode. And where is that going to appear? I think it's going to appear in Forge. OK, in the Borderlands pack. That's right. And it'll be uh, Adrenaline, I believe. The Adrenaline mode. First time that, that uh, Forge has had an Adrenaline mode. So that's brand new. Also has a brand new leaderboard. Mm -hmm. Play it. Um, go right there from the DG contest, or go into these uh, maps from the mission selection screen, and you'll be able to be entered in next week's contest. The update um, normally comes out on Tuesday nights, a little late this week, because one of our, our, our key programmers is a little under the weather. But uh, we'll have it out by the time you see this video. Um, what else? Jim. Well, we some new stuff this week. I, you know, I'm pretty excited. Uh, Not nearly so much so as I. I'm serious. One of my biggest contributions, I think, to this Kickstarter has been trying to plan these physical goods. And, and it has been no small undertaking, I assure you. But uh, we actually had some real results this week because we actually got samples in from the manufacturers. So I think there's been some pictures of stuff up on the website, uh, at the Kickstarter website, to show you, for example, the USB stick. Uh, but this week, we got a real USB stick. Yeah, the real yeah. stuff came in. And I mean, Jim is is right on this. He has been uh, handling multiple languages. Yeah, it, it's been an education, to say the least. Because um, you know we're not really typically in the business of no. making physical stuff. No, we don't but do we have that. learned a lot, and hopefully you will like what you see. Yeah, oh, hopefully we won't have to actually utilize that knowledge again in the future. But uh, but we uh, we did accumulate some along the way. Uh, can I show this one, please? So this is the uh, this is an actual sample of. Uh, uh, the USB stick, which is, of course, our, our famous gun tower, which a red double barrel gun tower. Yeah, it's uh, it's an awesome awesome piece, and, and they did an amazing job. Are we showing them a, a close up? As we'll show a close up, yes. Okay, well, yeah, and you get to see the detail on this, which they, they did an amazing job at. And then uh, it's an eight gig uh, USB, uh, which you know holds a, a ton of stuff. And sits proudly on your desk, shooting down any aliens it that does. might not come nearby. I probably can't see that if I put it down on the table. Oh, that's okay. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll do the close up. Okay. Uh, but then we have a new item. What? Yes, a what? new item. W not previously announced. This is a item. surprise. And we're going to add this to, uh, to some of the levels that we have already. The existing $150 tier, which gets you two posters, a t-shirt, and the USB stick, is now going to get an additional item mm -hmm. for that tier and all tiers above. So if you did a 225 mouse, if you did a video card, if you did anything above basically the 110 tier, mm -hmm. which is the discounted version of the 150 this tier. This new item is yours. This new item is included from now on. And, and, and it's included, yeah, yeah. whether even if you pledged before. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I almost got us into trouble again. <laughs> So this new item, I'm greatly anticipating this, yes. is uh, in the shape of a, a button, which you may be familiar with some certain office supply stores, but uh, changed to include a voice from our own Fletcher AI. So if I hit this button. My confidence is greater than 90%. <laughs> Isn't Wait. that cool? There are 20 random sounds that our button will make. And, and we it. wanted a magic eight ball from Defense Grid, and this is the Fletcher version. Yeah. He will tell you yes, no, maybe, perhaps ask later, in the way that only he knows how to do. And, and we're showing close-ups of the button, too? Of course, Jim. Outstanding. <laughs> you have prevailed against much greater odds. Yes, I believe so. I am safety. 
So yeah, uh, really fantastic. I, I think this is so much fun, and and, and uh, it's been going on, you know, nonstop in the office today. People walking around and whacking the button. And People have been pushing the button a lot. Now we have, we're really happy with this, but we think it came out a little dark. So the final versions will be a little sharper. And yeah, a little yeah. The, the the lights are not quite light enough, but uh, yeah. And then um, the next thing I want to do also is take an opportunity to have our art director, Dave McCoy, talk a little bit about some concept art for shirts. Here's Dave. Hi, it's Dave again. I'm the art director at Hidden Path and the art director for Defense Grid. So here are some of the designs we've come up with based on various things. Things like the, the enemies, the towers, sayings, the logo, of course, the entity, Fletcher. We hope you enjoy these designs. Of course, keep watching and we'll be refining them and you can pick the, the final ones you want. So check out the designs. We'll probably update them a little bit as time goes by as we finalize the specific ones we want to do. But then you'll actually choose which are going to be the top shirts and those are the ones that we'll produce and send out to you once the Kickstarter program closes. So thanks again and thanks for your support. So there you go. There's some great concept art pieces of shirts. We want your feedback. We want your comments. The artists can make even more. We're going to create lots of ideas for shirts. And then at the end of the Kickstarter, all the people getting shirts will vote on the concepts that are available and we'll narrow it down to the number of shirts we have to you know, limit to to manufacture. We think that's going to be three. Three of them. Yep. And then the people who are getting a single shirt can pick which one of those three. Yep. And the people getting all three will, of course, Boom. get Boom. Boom. I think even you would not be successful with that. <laughs> Thanks, Fletcher. <laughs> anyway, we're excited to add the audio button to the USB stick tier. We're excited that uh, we're giving you some, some new ideas for t-shirts. Uh, and we're just excited to be able to get closer to making Defense Grid 2. So thank you so much for your help. Very much. <laughs>